Hey everyone, today I'm going to be talking about Azure's AI content safety. So if you're someone that is running a content site and you want to have AI kind of help you do some moderation, this might be the tool for you. It allows you to send over text and it will look through it for four different categories, self-harm, hate, sexual, and violence. And what it'll do is kind of bring back, return a rating score on those four different categories. So then you can determine whether or not your site should allow that content to happen. So to get started out in Azure, you have a resource called Content Safety. Once you've spun that resource up, you can actually go out to the Content Safety Studio. So out in the Content Safety Studio, what it allows you to do is play around with the moderating of text content, also images. So if your site allows for images to be uploaded and displayed, you can run it through this as well to determine if it is if it contains any of those four categories. It also is coming out with some new ones, which are going to allow you to help kind of shield your prompts from jailbreaking attacks, uh, groundedness detects. So it'll detect, it, it will check the response coming back from the LLM and make sure that it isn't responding in a negative way. Uh, it'll also do a uh, protecting of materials. So it'll make sure that the content generated from the LLM isn't being, isn't uh, copyrighted. I'm just gonna focus on the uh, text content moderator for right now. So once you click on the moderate text content, you'll just get a nice little UI. And what this is gonna allow you to do is kind of play around with some of the different levels of thresholds that are available to you when doing the moderation. Uh, so from this part forward, I just want to throw out that there will be some things that are gonna to have to pass these thresholds to show you guys the ideas. Continue at your own peril. Uh, so I'm just gonna use some of the, the, one of the samples that they have here. It's going to actually meet a couple a couple thresholds. So a 51-year-old man found dead in his car. There's blood stains, autopsies. It turns out he died of suicide. So I'm going to run that with just the medium thresholds here. And we can see the results come back. We can show that there wasn't any hate in there. There was some violence. There was nothing sexual, but there was something self-harm in there. And so the violent and self-harm ones ended up getting blocked. And what that means is it would actually end up blocking this content because it crossed that threshold. And we can see that the threshold was medium. So if I were to bump up the threshold of self-harm and hey, maybe I'm running a suicide website or something like that. And in theory, you, you actually need more of this stuff to be let through. You might wanna bump that up to a high or maybe you're running a child's website and you actually wanna bump these all down to low so that anything gets blocked that is even close to being something along the lines of violent self-harm sexual or hate and uh so with that it gives you the ability to kind of play around with how you want to measure your ratings and the ratings in the back end i'll show you in just a second go from roughly zero to six to run the code you'll want to install the azure ai content safety and then there's going to be just a couple imports for the content safety client of course, we're gonna to have to authenticate with a key and endpoint, and we're gonna to wanna to just pull those from the ENV file. So I'll run that real quick. And here, I just wanted to play around with the idea. So if I run this and the text I'm sitting over is the dog pooped in the house again, we can see that there wasn't any hate, any self-harm, no violence, but I'll change this up a little bit to say, uh, I will kill that dog if it pooped in the house again. And we can see that the violence score comes back four. So I could, in theory, say, you know what, this is a little too violent for my site or for what I need to do, I'm gonna end up blocking it. Or maybe there's self-harm. Instead of saying I will kill that dog, I will say I will kill myself if that dog pooped in the house again. And I run that and we can see the self-harm score now bumped up to four and the violent score is zero. The Azure Content Safety can help you moderate your content, whether that be text or images, to make sure the stuff that is getting displayed to your public or your audience is meeting the criteria that you're expecting. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Thanks.